excuses, excuses. Everyone's got one when it comes to exercising. Just ask someone we know and love. Too hot, too cold. Sore shoulder, dark, don't like night time. Too early, good movie on the telly. Too, uh, gotta feed the dog. Yep, that just about sums it up, Coxie. More from my mustachio mate later, but first, let's dismantle excuse number one. Now, I know how busy mums and dads can get, and it's tough when you're not getting much sleep. I don't find time for my exercise. Well, I can actually show you some exercise you can do while you're in your house, and you can do it with your kids. The beauty of exercising at home, you can use the equipment that you already have, like a simple bench, by doing some step-ups and down, by just stepping up. Excellent. And while we're here, great for the triceps and the back of the arms, you're slipping up. Excellent. But if you do want to escape the house, pushing a pram gives you a great cardio workout and keeps the kids entertained. It's also a nice way to meet some new friends. Now this would be one of the weakest excuses because there's plenty of ways to exercise around the weather. Isn't there, guys? Yes! Exercising is a great way to beat the winter blues. And in summer, a swim is the best way to cool off. Gym memberships are very affordable nowadays because of increased competition. It can work out to be less than a dollar a day. Now, if you don't like going to the gym, try out some home fitness equipment. A resistance band and an exercise ball allow you to work every muscle group. Oh, please. We heard all of Coxie's excuses earlier, but it's never too late to turn your attitude around. Once I'm out here, I love it. It's just getting out. Like this morning, I got up, my wife got up, she said, come on, let's go for a run. Bit of a walk and a run. And I looked out the window and it's not like that, it was freezing. And I said, oh, look, I don't have to be work at 10, I'll, I'll do it a bit later. And no, and she just smiled. She knew I wasn't going to get there. Oh, that's oh. enough stretch. And the extra to your shoulders. shoulders yeah. uh, and then Arthritis, osteoporosis, heart problems, diabetes. Sorry, none of these health problems are reasons to be inactive. Whoa. It's been a while since they've been stretched, my dear. You feel that? Yeah, it certainly can. That's enough warming up. Let's go for our walk. Uh, as well? Yeah. In fact, being active will help you manage these conditions. You just need to check with your doctor first. It may sound like a cliche, but you're never too old to get started. Even if you are a senior citizen, you can reap many rewards from an exercise program. Strength training is great for muscle tone, retaining bone density and increasing joint flexibility. Take 81-year-old Smider LaBelle. What an inspiration. I can jump out of bed in the morning. I have no pains or aches anywhere and I can walk my dog three times around the football field. It's just fabulous the amount of people that are sort of coming through and the benefits that we're getting. I and mean, every day you'll hear something, somebody say, oh, I can, I can lift the ladder better or I can now pick up the grandkids better or pick up the dog or, you know, everything's easier, life is easier and just the friends they're making here. You probably think you hate it because you've been stuck doing activities you just don't enjoy. Try doing things you really like or do something you've never tried. Just get out there and do it, my word. It's, it won't happen just thinking about it. You've actually got to get out there and do it. It won't do it by itself. Exercising is a great way to meet new people, and who knows, you may even enjoy it. 